Online therapy enables me to join children in play by creating a window on their world, using the things that are meaningful for them, in a space that's safe, consistent and private, all of which are essential elements of therapy. Parents and guardians can support the work at the start and at the end, and during free play, children take me on their device to the spaces and places that are important to them to experience their inner world together in a way that we wouldn't be able to with social distancing. Some children need a regulating snack, others need a vestibular activity, and these are things that support sensory integration. Touch and movement are important elements to build into this work for children who've experienced developmental trauma. And where is safer to do this work than in the family unit at home? When we are on screen together, younger children have simplified interventions like this one, using drag and drop to create an online doll's house. You can add a whole range of images and characters, bringing my toys to the online space, and children can create and add images of their own toys. And we can look at size and space and dimension in a way that just takes imagination one step further. It's really important ways to create those images and stories and metaphors that children use to explore their relationship with themselves and with other people. This is a simplified sand tray intervention that we use again with drag and drop to allow children to explore through symbols the things that they'd normally put into a sand tray, but all done in a way that's safe and age appropriate. In addition to this, we have music, dance, puppets, dressing up. Children love sharing the things that we make together online or between the sessions using arts and crafts. It's all provided in a space that doesn't compromise on the current safety restrictions but helps children to explore online their big feelings.